The Great Henry McBride by Dr. Zeus. It's hard to decide," said young Henry McBride. "It's terribly, terribly hard to decide. When the fellow grows up and turns into a man, a fellow should pick the best job that he can. But there's so many jobs that would be so much fun. It's terribly hard to decide on just one. I might be a farmer. That sounds pretty good. That could be my job. And now, maybe it should. I'll buy a big farm somewhere out in the west, and raise giant rabbits, the world's very best. Yeah, that's what I'll do. That's the way I'll decide. I'll be the big rabbit man, Henry McBride. But now I don't know. I'm too smart and too clever to tie myself down to just one job forever. If I could have two jobs, now that would be swell. Besides, taking care of the rabbits I sell, why? I could be also a doctor as well. Then people will say, when I feel sick inside, I'll go to the rabbit man, Doctor McBride, the man who does two things. Yep, that'll be me, Doctor and Rabbit Man Henry McBee. But why only two things? Say, I could do three. I could build a big radio broadcasting tower and broadcast the news and the sports every hour, and then I'll be famous and known far and wide as broadcaster Rabbit Man Doctor McBride. Pooh, three jobs is nothing. I could still do more. I've got lots of brains. It's a cinch. I'll do four. I'll buy myself one of those seal trainer suits. And train seals to balance big balls on the snoot seat. Then people will say, "Young McBride is sure slick. He raises fine rabbits while healing the sick, while broadcasting news. And besides, he's so quick. He's all the time teaching some seal a new trick. And cow punching's great. So I'll do that, of course. And I'll do five jobs on the back of a horse." And when people see me coming galloping by, they cheer and they shout, "What a wonderful guy! The man who does everything! Wow, he's a whiz! Why, he's got the very best job that there is. The seal trainer doctor. Just look at him ride. The broadcasting rabbit man. Two gun McBride. Yep." I'll pick the very best job that I can when I'm finally grow up and turn into a man. But now, well, right now, when I'm still sort of small, the best job is dreaming, with no work at all.